Hi everybody, my name is Sean Thinjetti and you're watching Sean Thinjetti Art. I wanted to take a couple of uh, minutes this morning to record a pre-recorded video so I could talk to you about a couple of things. Obviously you can see what's on my board. This is something I'm going to be working on on my next live stream. But I wanted to take a little bit of time this day after Halloween, All Saints Day. I hope everybody had a wonderful Halloween, by the way, to touch base with you guys about the, the process of what I do and the process of uh, staying consistent as an artist and making work, but also more important than that, just being present, just being present in the moment when you're making stuff and being present and aware of what you're doing. And one of the things that's crazy about what I do and my job description, um, so to speak, is that I'm in the business of selling pictures and making pictures. And very often they're pictures of things that don't exist. And I'm trying to convince people to invest in stories that are not true, or I should say are not factual, that attempt to be true. And in many ways, I'm asking people to buy into dream worlds, whatever it is I'm doing, whether I'm doing a illustration for myself, for Nosfera the Cryptwalker, which is printed and getting ready to ship out. Everybody has till November 10th to get their addresses updated and, and then we'll be ready to rock and roll. And, you know, whether I'm doing, uh, again, paintings for Razor Fist or for Michael Bancroft or for um, Ethan Van Sciver or for John Malin or for Von Klaus or for uh, the great Eric Weathers, whatever it is I'm doing, my, my approach to it and the way I go about it kind of begins with just incredulity of the fact that that this is even a, a, a thing that's come about out of talent and a lot of hard work and a lot of discipline. And the thing that I wanted to to share with you guys is how much of a miracle it is to me that I do this kind of work and that I ended up here and, and obviously how grateful I am to all of you guys who support the channel, who are channel members, thank you so much, who sent super chats and also buy my artwork, buy my originals and uh, buy, you know, um, the comics, you know, back the comics as crowdfunded campaigns. And as I sit here and I look at the stuff that I'm doing, I guess the thing that I wanted to talk about was this idea of uh, that's it. <laughs> this that those two words or yeah I guess a contraction is in there somewhere um, but that's it and this idea that we don't really have control as creators over what that's it means to you guys what that means when someone gets any artwork that you do or anything that you do honestly it can be you know uh, shoot your relationship to any job you do, any work you do. It can be creative output, but it can also be uh, extend well beyond that. And I guess that's the thing that, that is so funny to me is that when you present something that you do and when you go out into the world and you do something, there's always going to be uh, somebody saying that's it. And sometimes they're going to be saying, that's it. And sometimes they're going to be saying, that's it. That's it. That's, that's the incredible thing about what we do. That's the incredible thing about what we do here. And for me, what's, what's so great about doing this, this, you know, uh, YouTubing thing, doing this Shanth and Jetty art thing, which is to say this YouTube channel these books I produce, these art books I produce, these stories I produce, this novel I'm working on, everything I do is, and, and the way that you guys respond to it and the way that you guys show up is saying, you know, oh, that's it. This is, this is what I want to do with my time. This is what I want to watch. This is where I want to be. This is what I want to put my money into. And that sometimes is, is overwhelming, but also I feel the exact same thing right? When I'm with you guys and I'm streaming and you guys are looking at, you know, um, the crazy things that I'm doing with the paint on paper or, or drawing or the, the things we talk about or the silliness of, um, 
you know, just the conversations we have that crack me up and are gold, which is why I love to say stay gold for a million and one reasons. And I guess that's the thing I've been really thinking about. For me, I think that's it. That's it. That's what I'm talking about. It's it's wonderful. And you can tell that in my reaction when you show up in stream and I go, hey, <laughs> like, you know, an old friend coming in to say hello. And I think that's the thing for me that 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 has been on my mind. And I just wanted to share that with you guys. Because I don't know, I, hopefully you'll get something positive out of it. Hopefully it'll be something that that, you know, affects the 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 flavor of the day or the nature of the day. If you walk around a little bit and and try to pay attention to those things that you look at and you go, that's it. And a little maybe less attention to the things you look at and go, that's it. Because I I tend to to direct my path towards the former and not the latter. I try to direct my path towards the things that inspire me. And you know, the people who who support me and back the work I do really inspire me. The artists of the past inspire me. The, the stories of the past inspire me. The kindness of strangers inspires me. The I walk around. <laughs> I'm one inspired young man, but I, I walk around and, and I see stuff that excites me. And if it wasn't for artwork and if it wasn't for I recently got the um, a collection of, of comics from my youth that I've been um, been meaning to to get. And I, I just flipped through it and I can remember all of those moments of seeing something. The first time I saw a comic book versus the first time I saw a comic book that made me say, that's what I want to do. That's what I want to do with my work. The first time I, I found folks online who articulated really clearly things that I was trying to, to figure out. And I thought, oh, that's it. That's what I'm talking about. And so I want everybody to have a great day. I hope everybody had a wonderful Halloween and is enjoying the fall. I don't know if you guys can hear outside the window, but I've got the window cracked because, um, you know, old New England homes don't heat equally. So sometimes I have to open the window, but I kind of like that because I like the fresh air coming in and I like the sound of the wind blowing through the trees and all of that kind of thing. It's uh, it's a great even the, the people passing by and, and the traffic. I love that kind of thing. But I hope everybody's having a wonderful time, a wonderful day. And um yeah, go out there and, and, and chase. That's it. And and when you see something you look at that inspires you, just take a second to to acknowledge it and and you know, bring it into your system so that you can, you know, have a richer life, a richer day, a richer experience, and you can bring that fullness to everything that you do. Because that stuff does. It it absolutely fills up your spirit and, and gets you ready for the day. So thank you guys so much for being here. My name is Jonathan Jetty. This is Jonathan Jetty Art. Nosfero is going to be shipping soon, and uh, I'm going to continue to be doing this YouTube channel. If you like the stuff that I do here, I welcome you to become a channel member. And if you enjoy the stuff that I'm doing here, subscribe. Um, hit the like button. Leave a comment. Every little bit of that stuff helps. But even if you do none of that, I appreciate you guys taking the time to listen to anything I do or anything I say. And uh, thank you for all of the the amazing things that you've brought in and uh, into clearer focus for me. So as always, speak easy, stay gold, keep the faith, and most importantly, peace. Because that's what my name means. So everybody have a wonderful day. Take care. I'll see you soon for a live stream and I'll be doing some painting. <laughs>